yeah, the software itself is structured uh, yeah, in, in building blocks, as shown here. The biggest building block is the portable core, which uh, contains all, all the core aspects uh, of, of its functionality, and it's written in a portable way, so it does not have any hardware dependencies. It depends on an asynchronous I.O. runtime, yeah, similar actually to what we've seen in, in the Amix stack, and uh, yeah, provides all this functionality on top of that. It uh, runs its own networking abstraction with its own HTTP and, and web socket implementation. Uh, a very uh, high efficient uh, JSON parser. Uh, so in, in terms of memory, this is the most efficient sort of implementation you could do because it does JSON parsing in place. And uh, yeah, packet queues for, for uh, scheduling downlinks and, and buffering uplinks. And the core engine is basically what drives the whole thing. Um, and does decisions about when certain uh, downlinks need to be scheduled, whether there's a collision, uh, if we see uh, an exhaustion of uh, duty cycle, these sort of things are, are managed all in, an, in, a portable, in a portable way without depending on actual hardware. Um, so the package views you're talking about, uh, are you able to handle a uh, backhaul going out for an hour, comes back on, you just retransmit everything that you've received your income? Yeah, so basically this sort of uh, buffering of uplink messages uh, can be done, or, or is it sort of the limiting factor there is the, is the RAM. But uh, Station does it in a quite efficient way that actually the payload and the metadata is stored separately, so we don't have to uh, allocate for each packet the maximum packet size, but only the actual payload that has been transmitted. So efficiency, you, you will see that in, in the actual architecture, plays a big role because we want to enable actually tiny embedded devices to act as gateways. Part of the uh, platform adaptation layer is, is uh, this uh, unified radio abstraction layer, which then can, is able to talk to different HELs, like the V1HEL or the V2HEL. Um, the platform layer is what abstracts the operating system towards the portable core. Um, in, in some cases, or in most cases, it will be Linux. This is why the uh, GitHub repository actually contains a Linux implementation for this uh, aspect. And uh, on this tiny gateway, there's actually free Artos running. So there's also a port of this for free Artos, which is used in, in this miniature gateway. Uh, the only third party dependency really is embed TLS, which is the TLS stack. And uh, yeah, also acts as the networking. Uh, stack towards the operating system.